one's invited, of course. Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another Vintage Collection action figure review. We're looking at Paplu from the Vintage Collection, even though it's not Paplu on the packaging, that is meant to be Romba. Um, but that's okay, the Kenner stuffed up back in the day and Hasbro aren't fixing the mistakes. Um, but that's okay, I understand what they're trying to do. They're trying to sort of show, um, you know, faith to the original line by giving them exactly what, what we got back then. Um, so this one is from the 50th anniversary of Lucasfilm. It is VC-190. There's the other two figures in the wave. Uh, I have already reviewed Leia. And uh, no sign of the ATST driver as yet, but uh, we'll stay tuned. Uh, as soon as I grab that one, I will do a review of it. So let's crack this up, little little guy open and take a look. All right, so here is the little guy, and this is a uh, pretty nice looking Ewok, to be honest. It's uh, definitely up there with the best. Um, I missed out on the Paplu uh, 2 pack that came out in the 2007 Legacy Collection. Um, that was back when they used to give us two Ewoks at a time, so there was a Paplu and Noah pack. Um, so yeah, I've, I've sort of done a little bit of research, and this one actually looks a lot better. Nicer articulation, nicer detail, uh, probably a slightly less weathering on the sort of hood that he has, but it's okay, it looks fine. Uh, his little accessories he comes with is his little, little knife there he's holding. It's nice, and that will uh, fit... Nicely there in his holster. It also comes with his little, uh, little. It's not really a spear, is it? Some kind of a, you know, walking stick or a tool. You know, it's got the two little spikes at the end. That's nicely detailed. It's a nice little wrap sort of around the top. It's sort of bits of fur and stuff wrapped around there. So uh, yeah, articulation-wise, it's not too bad. You know, it does have that sort of glaring sort of swivel joint in the middle there. I don't know if that's totally necessary, but uh, if you can line up that belt to sort of just sort of sit underneath, um, I might even be tempted to just put a couple of spots of glue in there just to sort of do that. Um, it does hide that sort of swivel cut line that's, that's in the middle of the figure there, and uh, you can still get that twisting movement. It doesn't, it's not hindered at all, so... That works quite well. Um, his head headdress does come off. We'll zoom up and get a look at the little guy's nightmare face. <laughs> it's good to think that if this guy met you in the forest, he wouldn't hesitate to kill you and cook you. But yeah, nice details. Nice little addition to the my Ewok clan. Um, there's still, I mean, there aren't many that I'm missing from back in the day. I pretty much got most of the Ewoks back in sort of 2011-12. Um, but yeah, the Paplu Noah pack, uh, two pack was one I'd, I'd missed. Um, and there was a three pack, which I've got one of them of. I remember Darth Phoenix 619 sent me one of them years and years and years ago. Um, but yeah, this is a cool little Ewok. I like him. Nice sculpt, cool articulation. I do like the uh, ball hinged hips. It's a lot nicer than the uh, swivels of old. But uh, yeah, I don't, don't, don't think that all the Ewoks need to be updated as such. But uh, you know, this is a nice one. And it's cool to have one that I haven't got yet. So it's not too bad at all. Yeah, let me know in the comments what you think. Would you like to see more Ewoks hitting the vintage line? I know a lot of people would like them to just sort of finish up the ones to finish the 96. And I'm having trouble getting him to stand. <laughs> but that's okay. I'll just hold him for the moment. Um, but yeah, let me know. Drop them in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and uh, give it a Give it, a, give it a subscribe to the channel if you want to see some more cool, cool figure reviews in the near future. And uh, hit the little notification bell too so you don't miss any new videos that come out. So thank you all very, very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Until my next one, may the force be with you always.